Hey folks, uh, Steve Konojewski, owner of Squeegee Clean here. Um, I just wanted to give this brief video because uh, we're starting to get calls and uh, I figured that we would. That's why I sent out a, a mass email to all my clients about ice damming. Uh, what you have here, this is on the south side. This is actually my roof. So sun is right up there, you know, hits the back of the house all day long. Um, so we're getting good melting back here. Temperatures are above uh, freezing. And I actually did not do anything to this roof. But this is what you want to see when the uh, snow begins to melt off of your roof. You want to be able to have, well, particularly if this wasn't the south side, and I'm going to show you another video in a second or two, about um, about three to five feet up from the, the gutter lines is where you want to have this snow. That allows it to melt. And then, of course, as you see it running down, I don't know if I can get in here, but runs down and then drips right into the gutters and then it's course transported away the way it should be just like when it rains however when you have ice damming um, problem is caused by uh, the snow which sits on top of the gutters and then it melts and then it freezes and I'm gonna take another video from the front of my home where I have to actually do some ice uh, damming prevention because I don't want water okay so now here we are on the front of the home of course, if the back is the south, the front would be the north, and you can tell that there is substantially a lot more snow on this uh, portion of the roof. This is a garage lower roof, and that, of course, is the upper roof. Upper roof has a little bit less snow, and that is because there is no attic in that portion of the roof. So the heat that's on the inside of the house is, of course, heat rises, and it is uh, going against the... Uh, drywall in the ceilings and it's melting that snow at a substantially uh, faster pace than this right here and there's actually uh, this is all attic above here and it's actually uh, a deep attic too where I can stand in it's about six eight feet tall so the snow is not going to melt off this portion of the roof nearly as fast of course you get no sun out here so as you have days in the upper 30s nights in the low 20s teens you're getting freeze thaw freeze thaw freeze thaw so I don't know how close I can get in here where you can see it but there actually is some ice starting to form on the edge of the shingles. Now, um, I don't have a gutter guard on this particular gutter. I did have one on the back gutter. Gutter guards are a good preventative. They won't necessarily stop the problem from occurring, but at least it allows the snow not to get in the gutter. So let me see if I can get a different approach or a different angle hone out here. So now what's going to occur if I don't get this snow off the first three to five feet of this roof, I'm going to start getting water back up. I could already tell from the way that the ice is starting to sheet right, right there. That's a big block of ice. I'm going to get back out. Okay. So this is ice damming and it occurs when there is a lot of snow on the roof, I'm getting lots of calls about it. As a matter of fact, I just had a lady down in Red Lion call me. She already has water coming through her ceilings, down her walls. She's been in contact with her uh, insurance company, and they haven't given her any answers yet. We have a client of ours down in uh, uh, Hunt Valley who was away during a storm a couple of years ago. Came home to water everywhere. $43,000 claim. Fortunately, the insurance company caught it, and uh, they were able to give her the money. But sometimes insurance companies do not cover this stuff. So what you need to do is if you see this on your roof, a neighbor's roof, anyone that you know that might have this problem, please tell them to give me a call or an email. Steve Konerjewski, owner of Squeegee Clean, 717-465-2822. Steve at myfilthywindows.com. Once again, Steve at myfilthywindows.com. Have yourself a great day, and thanks for viewing.